In this video, I'm going to show you how to deploy your project to a real website. In this case, we're going to use GitHub Pages. They are free, you only need a, an account. So subscribe to GitHub Pages or github.com. For create a repository, you need to head over to github.com slash new. Another name, landing Udemy in this case. Single page for my Udemy course is okay, it's a description. Next, we need to choose between public or private. I'm gonna, well, public is free, private is a paid version, so stick with public. And finally, we have this initialize this repository with a readme. You have to check this. And with all of this in place, let's click on repository or create a repository. Next, I have to open the terminal. So let's open terminal and you have to make sure you have installed JIT. And if you press JIT and you can see all of these commands, that means that you have already installed JIT. If you don't see anything like this and you see an error, you have to install JIT in your computer. So let's, I am the users and my username. So I'm gonna open the desktop and I'm gonna list all the files. You can see here I have this folder BD and landing page. These are here. So I'm gonna create a new directory and cut here landing and sitting into this landing. And I'm gonna copy this URL. So you're gonna clone this repository, you clone and then the URL and, it's, and it will clone the URL. So I have to list all the files and you can see landing Udemy is the same as my repo in the Udemy and the LSA. So you can see all the files and you have this JIT and this readme file. If I open this folder, you can see this readme file right here. Next, we need to make a checkout. So again in the terminal, let's I'm gonna clear this and JIT checkout. B and the checkout has to be named JH pages for GitHub pages. Now you can see that we, he, we saw here switch it to a new branch, GitHub pages. So let's continue. And I'm gonna copy all of my files on my project. I'm gonna copy all of these files and paste it right here. Well, not right here, in the folder. So I'm gonna, right here in the landing Udemy. Next, I have to add these files, git add and a dot. The dot means add all of these files. Next, I have to commit these changes, git commit a m, and I have to add a name. So, single page for my course in Udemy. And you can see all the files are list. So, I have to push all of these files, git push, origin, and get pages. So I'm gonna, it will upload all the files and when, when it's finished, I'm gonna come back again. Now it has finished uploading the, the files, but you can see we don't have, well, where, or a URL for visit or files. But don't worry, you have to write your username first. So for example, it's gonna be https slash slash github well your username in this case juan pablo gdl dot github dot io slash and then the name of this repo landing udemy and then press enter and now you have your project in a real website and it working as expected. One thing you have to know, know else is this form is using PHP and GitHub pages are only working with JavaScript, CSS, and HTML. So this form isn't gonna work. But you, you have a free website which you can share with your friends or a possible employee. So Make sure, well, you have to make sure this, is, this isn't gonna work, the form, but everything else is working as expected.